Hi, everybody. Everybody, all three of you that have watched my videos. Well, anyway, once again, welcome to Shed Vivalist. This week, I'm working on the RV. And what we have is like an old 1994, I think. 28-foot uh, Class C motorhome. And you know how brutally cold those can be. Because they have about, you know, that much insulation. And, yeah, it doesn't work out too well. So this one obviously needed a lot of work. And what we did is we replaced the roof. Because the roof was in awful condition. And it had seeped down and, you know, had all the mildew and, you know, rot and all that. Um... So anyway, I'm not going to get into that. What I was going to talk about today was insulation. So what I did is I replaced the roof. And uh, what I did when I replaced the roof is I went over it with uh, I put one and a half inches of closed cell foam and then a subfloor decking on top of that. And then the uh, rubber roof glued down over that. And so what that did is gave us an extra R whatever, R7 I think, on the outside. And then on the inside where it had leaked through and damaged the interior paneling, we had torn out most of that and, uh, and replaced it with new uh, paneling and we insulated the walls so the walls are re paneled and insulated with another inch of closed cell foam throughout the whole motorhome so what we have is what amounts to I think about R11 inside and uh, on the walls and uh, more than that actually R15 on the ceiling and today I'm working on the floor so as you can see uh, the old floor had zero insulation you know all those all they do is is put flooring down or carpet right over the funky OSB decking and it wasn't a bad motorhome actually I think they're all made like that because they have to make them as cheap as they possibly can 